All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to start this video or lesson by giving a praise, design, and glory to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Racha, Kodash, the bonds of the apostles, and the elders of Great Millstone, and Shalom. Uh, first and foremost, uh, to the 144,000, all right, as well as the rest of the elect of the nation of Israel. This is Aratiza from the Great Millstone, James Land Camp. And uh, so I just want to hit this quick article. Um, this may be a short video but um this article centered around the MOTB all right which we know the MOTB you know we use it as an acronym for the mark of the beast written of in Revelation 13th chapter getting around maybe the 15th or 16th verse on down John wrote or he saw and he wrote about um what is known as the mark of the beast, all right, which is a, a which is a, which which we believe and know is a implantable uh, brain device or or, or, uh, or a chip, all right, that Esau Esau being a so-called white man is going to implement, force and make mandatory in the very near future on the people to take, all right, and through this device, as the scripture says, um. That no man may buy or sell, save he that have the mark. All right. Um, through this device is how one one will be able to, you know, basically buy and sell. All right. And we know that you can't survive without being able to, you know, buy and sell things. All right. You know, you know, you, you know, you can't you can't run a business. You know, you can't, um, um, you know, buy food. Things, things that you need to be able to survive. All right. So Esau is going to condense everything. Essentially, you know, the world, as we know, is going to be cashless. And um, we already see things trending in that direction. All right. We see these different apps, uh, um, the, the Google Wallet, and the Apple Wallet or Apple Pay, where <laughs> basically now you don't even need a physical wallet anymore. You got your wallet on your phone. All right, your damn car, your car, uh, your car insurance uh, info, your vehicle registration, your driver's license, your debits and credit cards. You can all have that on an app on your phone, and you can just you know go and tap your phone on the um on the thing. You can pay you know you can pay for your items. That's where society's going. All right, and um, unfortunately, you have you know certain you know, Israelite groups that still can't get over it and see that that's what the scripture is talking about but here it is here right this is an article from a website called quartz as you see there and it says um in the headline it says Neuralink rival synchron or synchron is recruiting patients for a big brain c hit or chip clinical trial then the caption is says the startup uh, a rival of Elon Musk's Neuralink launched a registry to recruit patients and healthcare providers for the trial. All right. And when, one thing we always say is that the MOTB or the, RF, the RFID microchip, as well as uh, World War III, they go hand in hand. Because at the same time, when you look in the news, you see a lot of, um, you know, uh, um, you know, basically things are intensifying as far as in the Middle East. With the different wars and, and things of that nature going on, and here it is. They here they are. They 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 getting this uh this uh chip ready, man. All right. We know that World War Three is not going to happen until the hour of temptation comes. All right, as we say over and over in our in our videos as it pertains to this topic. Um. All right, and uh, I'll just read a little bit from this article. I'm not gonna read the, it's, it's it's not long, but I'm not gonna read the whole thing. It's kind of short to the point, but it says um, Brooklyn-based brain chip startup Synchron or Synchron launched a registry Monday to recruit patients and healthcare providers ahead of a planned large-scale clinical trial. By the way, this article goes back to Monday, which I believe actually was the uh, day of the um, solar eclipse, right? Which which was what April eighth. 
All right, so that's spiritual. This article came out on that day. All right, it says the company arrival of Elon Musk Neuralink produces a brain implant known as brain computer, excuse me, brain compute, brain computer interface or B, uh, BCI that helps paralyzed patients control electronic devices like computers and smartphones with their thoughts. See, and that goes into the miracles that it speaks about in Revelation 13. Um, that speaks about the uh, the beast was able to work. Uh, 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 miracles, roughly paraphrasing. All right, but these are um, left-handed miracles. <laughs> you know, they're going through the uh, AI technology and all that. You know, it's not real. It's a uh, artific It's uh, artificial. All right. It says, uh, "Quote: We are thrilled to launch our community-centered." BCI registry, Synchron CEO and founder Tom Oxley said in a statement, there's a grassroots movement happening with BCI. We are creating an avenue for potential users and their physicians to engage and stay connected while we prepare for the next stage of clinical trials. Since Oxley told Reuters that the trial could include up to dozens of participants and that 120 Clinical trial centers have already expressed interest in offering to help run the study. The startup did not provide more details on when it expects regulators to approve of the clinical trial. So it's this 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 thing is moving along, man. They're getting these trials going. And before you know it, this thing is going to be pushed out to the public. This 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 is where all things are, are, are leading to. Alright, and again, a profit. As, as scripture says, um, let's get some scriptures here. Um, what's that? Which is a wise man for foreseeth the evil. I think that's Proverbs twenty-two and three, if I'm not mistaken. Right. Uh, Proverbs twenty-two and three: A prudent man foreseeth the evil. And hideth himself, but the simple pass on and are punished. See that we represent those prudent men from the apostles on down, the elders, the bishops, all the rest of the brothers that are, you know, that are doing the work of the Lord. <clears throat> all right, where 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 are those prudent men, those prudent men, excuse me, those wise men that could that could foresee the danger that's that's approaching. All right, to, to foresee what's 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 coming, what's What's to to excuse me foresee what's ahead of us, man, and a, a part of that is this RFID chip technology. All right, but then you got other men out here that are Israelites that can't see it. You know, it said the um the mark of the beast is sin, or it's uh um you know this and that. They say it's every they say it's any any and everything except what it is, man. See that? So the prophets are here to to foresee and foretell you of what's to come ahead all right and we're spiritually hiding ourselves in the bosom of Yahweh Bashim Shai. we're hiding ourselves in his spirit all right so we had that head that hedge around us all right as long as we continue to endure and trust in him as the scripture says um in Revelation 3 I believe because that has kept the word of my patience Excuse me, I will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come and try all the world. All right. So the Lord's going to protect us in that time where we don't have to go down to them, uh, wherever, you know, to them, to them chipping station to get to get to get digitally tagged. No, we just trust in the Lord. You know, as the scripture says, my servant shall eat, but you shall be hungry. Now, of course, it's um easier said than done. Because it is going to get real out here, man. All right, that squeeze is coming, but we just have to continue in that time, continue to trust in, in Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. But we foresee these things coming. All right, these, these articles is it, it, just showing clear as day what this man is trying to do, man. All right, um, wouldn't be right if we didn't get 2 Corinthians. 
chapter two is pretty much a staple in these uh type of videos all right second corinthians 2 in verse 11 lest satan should get an advantage of us for we are not ignorant of his devices all right we know that the so-called white man esau is the physical counterpart of satan this is a part of his devices which devices means wicked evil plots all right let me check the other translation here to see how it's worded just to bring the point home even more right this is the uh, same scripture in the NLT version so that Satan will not <clears throat> excuse me will not outsmart us for we are familiar with his evil schemes. see that so the elect is not going to be deceived into taking this 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 thing Okay, but the what people are blinded, people are followers. You know, basically people are going to choose the wide gate. I think it says that in Matthew 13th chapter, if I'm not mistaken. You know, but those who are wise are going to choose the straight gate and go and go and go through the path of difficulty. So the elect is not going to be outsmarted by this devil. See that? This is for we are familiar with his schemes. All right, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, has given us. As uh, you know, the elders say, the, you know, the Heavenly Father gave us a no-look pass in the spirit to where we can identify and, 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 and you know, figure this thing out. All right. The Heavenly Father gave us Satan's playbook, man. So he's not going to be able to get uh, one up on the hopeful elect. All right. We're not taking the chip. If, if, if we are part of the elect, the elect is not going to, you know, bow the knee to the image or, you know, let this man in, in you know give us his mark. It's it's it's, it's not gonna happen. All right. Uh, that was Yahweh Shabli that said that the, the um roughly paraphrasing that the elect cannot be plucked out of the Lord's hands. Okay, the elect belong to Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. So it's not gonna work. But it's our job as the prophets is to you know to put the warnings out to report you know, the different news that we see pertaining to this, because this is a very, a very key prophecy, man. All right. Esau's AI is, uh, you know, this, this this brain chip, brain implant. This is where society's going. And it's clear, as the scripture says, that the um, scripture says that the end is manifest. Second Ezra chapter 9, verse, uh, we have verse 5 or 6. All right. So every day, Every day, every week, every month, every year that goes by, it gets more and more clear of the plans of the wicked, plans of this devil. And we know that based upon what Yahweh Shemashah has showed us. You know? So, this is a couple, really that's the point. Alright, these uh, type of videos not very long. Alright, we all know the scriptures, of course, Revelation 13 chapter. We quote it so much, we don't even have to really read it. Cause it's, I mean, it's really not, really not much more to say on it, man. We just, is it, it, this thing is happening, man. All right. So, with that, Lord willing, you was edified as well as informed, giving all praises, honor and glory to Yahweh Hashem Yahushai, Hashem Chakodash, Lord willingly. To the next uh, video, I'm gonna say Shalom.